All right, Max, here's a look at run two, Bromley. He did a great job in second run, ninth place. Really, uh, you know, turned it up after, you know, conservative first run like all your your teammates did. But, you you know, you sent it in this one. Great job. I think we really learned that we, we, we can't put ourselves in a hole after the first run. And it's a two-run race, and we got to be going for it on each run. Let's, let's check you out. We have next one, sir. Place, man. Yeah. Check that. Guy's been talking the whole way, huh? Yeah. He does, he did it. That is some nice motion right there, boy. That is skiing with touch. All right, good job. You probably hear Coach Jay and Sanderson saying that you were talking the whole way down, and you were. I don't know what you were saying, but... Yep. All right, it was a good run. Came in here, good position. Long outside leg, short inside leg. Looks like ankle flexion, fairly level. Got a little pole plan, got some movement. You know, this term, you know, you kind of feathered the top of it, drifted the top, and I think really got to carve the top of the turn. There's, you know, with, with this court set and, and the turning rays of your skis, we got to commit to it and really carve the top of the turn and be clean. The better kids that day were. And it's just, you know, scrubbing some speed there and trying to pressure down here. And you can see it's really all the turn is down here, all the pressure, and that just dumps some speed. It's really abrupt. You can see the spray going on, right? So we, we got to carve more of the top of the turn. You know, a little bit of a skid here to get it going, but a much better job in that turn. Nice job there. Very clean. I don't see hardly any spray there. That's a good job. Um, you, you've, you've improved. You, you're not as bent over at the waist, uh, which is good. This is a pretty good body position. Can we move our hands a little more forward, driving them forward by the gate? Yes. looking turn there you, you had a little movement you got your hips up a little bit forward that's good over the top of the boots there good job this you know for the most part this is this is this is good stuff we just have to clean up on, on a couple times the top of the, the top of the turn trust yourself and your and your skis to roll those things up to a high edge angle platform and really stand on them. Stand on the outside ski, I mean. This one's a little terrain here. You know, you could have had a little more direction done above the gate because you went over it with skis, you know, going, going out, uh, you know, going out here, right? If we had just a little more turn above and going this way, you know, you're trying to you're trying to turn over this little knoll, this ridge, hard. So you, you didn't get it done. You're on the inside ski, and you had it slid down in, into the hole there a little bit. So we're going more across the hill now, and what the better kids were more diagonally. But you recovered okay. It made this one coming in tougher because you don't have much elevation or space above. But you did a really good job to get that turn done quickly. And that is our goal, to really have short, powerful arcs and longer transitions by really standing on the outside ski, bending it and getting off that downhill ski and moving to the new ski. So, did a good job there. Great job on this run. Like I said, if we can clean up the top of the turn a little bit, um, it'll make you even faster.